90 people from my ward showed up for my baptism. Oh. Not because I'm like this popular person, but they were the people who had sat with me for nine months while I was reading the scriptures, trying to figure out how to move from the system I had been in into an, a new system. And they were all there with me. It was such a joy. So the same way that you said you're trying to get out mm -hmm. of, of an old way of thinking of things into a new one, obviously Alma, it's much more extreme, mm -hmm. but he was a religious guy, right? Mm -hmm. He had beliefs, he felt strongly about them, but something changed. Okay. And so he and the others are, are thinking through all that. And then if we can jump into the scriptures, so in Mosiah chapter 18, okay. This is the beginning of a list, right? Okay. We had those first two. You're willing to be called his people and you're willing to bear one another's burdens. And then it says in verse nine, yea, and are willing to mourn with those that mourn. Yea, and comfort those that stand in need of comfort and to stand as witnesses of God at all times and in all things and in all places that ye may be in even until death that ye may be redeemed of God and be numbered with those of the first resurrection, that ye may have eternal life. What does that mean to stand as a witness? The missionaries taught me, but long before that, I was introduced to the Book of Mormon by a, a member who was not a missionary. And he was kind of brave and bold in introducing <laughs> wow. it to me. And I honestly was all the way to Alma before I met the missionaries. Wow. Okay, so tell me how that was. What was it like? What did this friend of yours do to be a witness by introducing the Book of Mormon to you? I actually started in the Book of Moses. We were having a conversation about Moses, and he says, you know, I think some things about Moses that you don't because I have scriptures that you don't have. I said, <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> what are you talking about? And he said, yeah, I, I do. And I had him text me a link to the church's website where I read the book of Moses. And I didn't even know what I was looking at in some ways. I finished the Pearl of Great Price in a week and then I kind of thought, well, I have to start on the Book of Mormon. <laughs> and it, it was just the, I, I think he just followed my curiosity. <laughs> 